Welcome to this uh, Windows Computers and Technology channel. And this is a quick little video for those that have printers. Now, there's a 16 year old uh, security flaw that was discovered in certain printers, not all printers, but uh, certain printers do have this uh, security flaw that's been discovered, 16 uh, year old security flaw. You know, I was talking yesterday on one of the videos of how you know, some of the very old code have security flaws that, you know, take a lot of time to be discovered. And this is one of them. So it uh, gives hackers the possibility to go to admin rights. Now, this at, apparently affects mostly uh, printers that are from HP and Xerox. Um and it has to do with and even samsung printers but you'll have that uh, also on the hp page uh it's not a terrible flaw in the sense that unless you have access to the computer itself it's not a problem so that means it's not a remote code you're not going to be attacked over the internet using this flaw it has to be somebody at the computer that decides to use this flaw. But still, um, HP, Xerox, Samsung are actually actively telling everybody, make sure you've got the latest drivers installed. It has to do with a file from these printers that is ssport or ssport.sys, which is um, a driver for specific printer models. And of course, it could lead to a local escalation of privileges. And um, that using what's something called buffer overflow. So if you have an HP printer, uh, go to the hp.com website, go to the printers and drivers and the printers. Make sure that you check for the latest updates on drivers. It's simply a question of updating your drivers for the printer. So. Uh, Xerox, Samsung, NHP, you should be going to the manufacturer website, find your printer's model number, and make sure that you have your printer uh, updated for its drivers. Sometimes, uh, if you have a printer, you might have the printer um, that has its own little, um, you know, manager that can actually, uh, you know, check for updates and make sure that you're updated so you can go through your manager the, the HP manager for example in my case I've got a Epson printer which is not affected apparently but whatever printer you have even if it's not affected or it's not one of the brands that is affected here it's not a bad idea to maybe take a peek and try to find if they have a more recent driver just to make sure that you stay on the safe side with security so whatever printer model you have, just go to the manufacturer page, hp.com. Uh, I believe HP now has drivers for Samsung also, but you can check Samsung or Xerox or whatever, epson.com or whatever, depending on the brand that you have. Make sure you have the latest printer driver. It actually fixes the problem and makes sure that you are safe on uh, your computer. But like I said, it's not a you know real bad security flaw. There needs to be somebody taking control at your end for this to happen. If you enjoyed my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.